baseball now. And Mitchell Garver threw out 39% of would-be base dealers and hit well at the plate. It was a good year in the Minnesota Twins organization for the former Lobo catcher. It was a really good year for me. And, you know, I, I just took my successes and put them in my back pocket and went on the next day. You know, I had to get back to work because it seems like there's always a guy behind you that, that wants to take your spot. Mitchell Garver enjoyed an all-star season in 2014, catching for the Cedar Rapids Colonels in the single-A Midwest League. Down the way and swung on, drilled in the air to left field. Garver hit 16 homers and drove in 79 runs for the Colonels. A long way from La Cueva to now. When I was in La Cueva, I was just a... I was just a small, you know, scrawny senior, and I came into to, uh, UNM, and I was just a small fish in a big pond. Baseball started to pick up momentum for Garver as a low ball. The accolades started rolling in during his junior year, and after his senior season, Garver found himself picked in the ninth round by the Minnesota Twins. I got into the weight room and got bigger, and Coach Birmingham taught me how to hit. Kind of snowballed from there, and here I am now. Garver is having fun trying to work his way up and will leave for spring training with the Twins next month. I do have a chance to make an impression, and that's what I'm going for. You know, I, they, they've seen me play for about a year and a half now, and they know what kind of player I can be, but now it's time to put it up against the professionals, you know.